Welcome to the Animal Kingdom, a land full of fierce predators, camouflage artists, and yes, even a few death fakers. Here, here, I'll help you back up. Blah, no, I'm still dead. <laughs> there are several reasons specific species of animals like to pretend to go belly up. Some of them play dead to catch their prey, others implement it as a defense mechanism to stay alive. Oh no, we're playing dead. Oh, play dead. We playing dead, oh my god, we playing dead. Are you ready to meet some of these living dead animals? Then check out these 10 incredible animals that fake death. Number 10, Livingston's Child. Okay, so maybe your goldfish really was sleeping. The Central American Sichlid fish only pretends to be dead to attract its unsuspecting prey. Lurking in Lake Malawi in East Africa, Livingston Sichlid has been seen playing dead and sinking to the bottom of the lake and lying motionless on its side, waiting for a moment to strike. Yep, this underwater predator even has camouflage-like markings on its body that makes it look like a decaying fish, and scavengers are attracted to what initially looks like an easy meal. After near instantly and miraculously coming back to life, the Sichlid kills and devours its cleanup crew in no time. Two species of cichlid fish are known to fake death to attract scavenging species to dine on, and both use their blotchy coloring to resemble a rotting carcass. Not bad, Livingstons. Number 9. Leaf Litter Frogs Like the clever Livingstons, southern Brazilian leaf litter frogs were also recently observed faking death by lying motionlessly on their backs, shutting their eyes, and throwing back their arms and legs. This species of frogs are known to maintain their exaggerated death pose for up to two minutes. But why do they fake death to such a dramatic extent? Well, it's not that uncommon for frogs to play dead in some ways. But scientists say leaf litter frogs' behavior has not been seen before in this species, and is far more dramatic than any other from species they have seen before. The technical term for what they do is thanatosis. Thanatosis is a learned defense mechanism by which animals play dead to trick specific types of predators that look for movement in potential prey. Looks like possums aren't the only ones who fake death to save their own lives. Number 8. Pigs Farm animals like cows, goats, chickens, and pigs have been known to go into a trance-like state for minutes at a time without moving a single muscle before returning to normal. Tonic immobility is considered to be a fear potentiated response induced by physical restraint and characterized by reduced responsiveness to external stimulation. In plain English, they play dead to avoid predators. That being said, some pigs will play dead to get a belly rub out of their owners, like this one right here. Real quick, before you meet our next death-faking animal, here's a quick challenge for you. If you can leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and turn on the notifications in less than 5 seconds, you will have 10 years of amazing luck. Hurry up and try it, it actually works. Number 7. Hognose Snakes American hognose snakes are a type of death faker that even use scents in their act. Check out this hognose snake playing dead. Aside from just laying still and playing dramatically dead, the snake produces a foul-smelling odor as part of the whole act. Here, here, I'll help you back up. Blah, no, I'm still dead. <laughs> they go through the same process of thanatosis, but in addition to other creatures, they emit their smelly odor from their anal glands. Oh, and sometimes they'll go as far as spewing up blood while faking dead. Yep, these snakes clearly give off the message that there is something wrong with them, and are therefore best not attacked or eaten by predators. Not bad, hognose snakes. Number 6. Fire-bellied Toads Like their leaf litter cousins, Asian and European fire-bellied toads get extremely dramatic and faking death. These toads are actually scientifically classified as frogs, and, when playing dead, they'll arch their backs and twist their limbs to show yellow and orange warning markings on the bottoms of their feet. So, not only do they play dead, they also try to ward off predators with their bright colors. They may also go possum and flip under their backs to show similar distinctive markings on their bellies, hence why they're called fire-bellied toad. The colors are a natural warning sign to predators, letting them know their skins have got strong toxins. It's unclear why they feel the need to play dead in addition to showing off their bright colors, but 
Some scientists believe these toads use the lack of movement caused by their death faking to focus the predator's attention on their colors, which they might ignore if these frogs were in movement. Either way, who would want to eat a frog with fire in its belly, right? Number 5. Opossum We all know possums to be classic death fakers, but did you know they throw in a foul smell to enhance the whole act, just like hognose snakes? Yup, aside from putting on its highly convincing death grimace, at least the American opossum is known to additionally assault its potential predator's sense of smell all while lying belly up. That's because playing dead sometimes just isn't enough. After all, who wouldn't go for a free meal? But predators do know that dead or dying animals can harbor dangerous bacteria and other harmful organisms, which is why they instinctively avoid eating them. Smart move, possums! Number 4. Nursery Web Spider Did you know faking death is a fairly common survival technique among invertebrates like ants, beetles, and other insects? But would you have guessed spiders use the same behavior to obtain sex? That's right. During courtship, the male nursery web spider offers the often much larger female an insect wrapped in silk. If the larger female attempts to steal the food without mating, the male acts as additional food by playing dead and is later dragged off along with his gift. The male uses faking death to hang on to his gift and stay close to the female. Then, while the female is distracted with feeding, the male comes to life and resumes its attempts to mate. The nursery web spider is the only known animal that plays dead to induce mating. There are some praying mantis males who freeze when trying to get away from cannibalistic females after mating, but this is no mating strategy and can best be described as let's not get eaten after sex strategy. Number 3. Sharks Worried about shark attacks? Some experts say that punching a shark near the eyes will get it to back off, but violence is not the answer. Others say you should just touch their nose. Not sure how well that would work when it's charging at you with open jaws. But did you know lemon sharks are rendered practically harmless when flipped on their backs? Yep. Believe it or not, these apex predators of the ocean go completely limp after about 15 seconds and will play dead long enough for scientists to conduct experiments on them. Heck, they'll even let you throw in a belly rubber too if they trust you enough. Don't believe us? Check out this incredible diver giving a shark a massage. Number 2. Ducks Was it duck, duck, goose, or duck, duck, death? We can't remember, but one thing we do know, when faced with danger, certain species of duck will play dead. According to scientists, it's the same tonic immobility defense mechanism pigs use to avoid harm. Unfortunately though, it's not a very good one. These death feigning fowl are often eaten anyway. What bird brains? Perhaps if they took a trick or two out of the Stinky Possum's book, it'd work out a little better for them. Oh well. Before we reveal number one, be sure to check out other amazing videos on our channel and give us a like if you enjoyed this video so far. Tell us in comments which one of these you like the most and why. Number one, Brown Snake. Our last, most incredible faker of death is the brown snake. These snakes will pull off their act all the way through. Generally speaking, snakes are good actors, but the baby brown snake, also known as Storaria decayi, will freeze completely if approached by a menacing predator. Even if touched, smelled, and prodded, the snake will remain completely stiff and in character until the danger is passed. The same goes for when scientists prod this masterful death-faking snake. If you want to see just how convincing these snakes can be, check out this brown snake giving an Oscar-worthy performance. Alright folks, those were 10 animals that faked death for you. How would you respond to a moment of danger? Would you fight, flight, or freeze? Would you emit any foul smells, or just make sure you don't move a muscle until the danger is passed? Be sure to let us know in the comments below. Oh, and if you were amazed by this video, you should definitely check out our related videos.